Hello everyone, Nut Free Mama here. <laughs> Today I'm going to show you how to make a well butter spider cookies. <laughs> Alright, let's start off with our ingredients. First you need a half a cup of granulated sugar and a half a cup of brown sugar packed. So I have both of those right here. You need a half a cup of wow butter, a half a cup of butter softened, which is one stick, one egg, one and a half cups of all-purpose flour, a half, a half a teaspoon of baking powder, and three-fourths teaspoon of baking soda. And then that's all you need for the cookies. And then to make the spiders, you need 72 Whoppers, some melting chocolate, and then if you want to do something for the eyes, I found these little sprinkles that I'm going to do for eyes, or you could have no eyes, it doesn't matter. And then also you need some extra sugar for rolling, I forgot to mention that. So let's get started. Let's preheat our oven to 375. Next we are going to add our sugars, wow butter, butter, and egg, and just beat that with an electric mixer until it is nice and combined. Okay, that looks great. So next, in a large bowl, you just want to combine your flour, baking soda, and baking powder, and just stir that with a whisk. And then we are going to slowly add our dry ingredients to our wet ingredients, and just mix that um, each time. Okay, that looks good. I scraped down my sides and just made sure everything was mixed in there well. So next, you want to line a cookie sheet with parchment paper and get out your sugar, and we're going to just scoop out one inch um, sections of this and just roll it into balls and then roll it into the sugar and place it on your cookie sheet. Okay, my first batch is ready to go into the oven. I have 18 here. I'm not sure if mine might be a little bigger than they should be. Um, this is the batter I have left and I'm guessing you're supposed to be able to make 36 of these. So um, I'm going to put these in the oven for 8 to 10 minutes. Okay, my first batch just came out of the oven, and I immediately placed two Whoppers. So try to find, if you can, a smaller one and a bigger one, so the head and the body, but it doesn't really matter. So I'm going to let these cool for a couple minutes and transfer them over to another rack. I don't really want to put them on a cooling rack. I'm just going to put them on another cookie sheet because I really don't want them to fall apart. Okay, my last batch of spiders is out of the oven. I'm going to let those cool, but I can get to work on the legs and eyes for this batch. So I'm just going to melt my melting chocolate in the microwave in 30 second increments till it's nice and smooth. And just to let you know, I was able to get 32, so I was close to the 36, um, but mine are a little big, so if you make them a little smaller than this, you should be able to get 36. Okay, that is ready to go, so I'm going to let that cool for a couple of minutes and then put it in a Ziploc bag and cut the very, very tip off because you really want it to be a very thin line for the legs. Okay, so my spiders are finally done. That took a long time. So basically what I did, cut the very tip off of my chocolate, made the legs. You just start, you know, towards the middle of the body. Two on each side, go back, and two on each side come up towards the face. I am so happy with the way these turned out. They are so cute. And then if you want to put the eyes on, which I did, you could just dab two little pieces of chocolate. Or sometimes the Whopper is still melted, so you can just add the eyes right onto it. And I just used the yellow and the black and the green. But these did turn out really, really cute. So I'm excited to see what Taste Tester thinks. Oh my gosh, these really look like little spiders everywhere. All right, let's go see what Taste Tester thinks. Taste tester, oh, a scary dragon. Are you a nice dragon? Yeah. Nice, okay, have a taste. Okay. Yum, yummy. Do you like it? Yeah. All right, everyone, come back and see us again, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and one more, happy Halloween. Happy Halloween, bye. Bye.